I mean, it's a great feeling knowing that I can make the team with like people that are better better than me. Knowing that I'm this young and I've accomplished something this great, it's a great feeling. Um, they just told me to just, like, stay calm, like, do what I know I'm supposed to do, follow my coach's instruction, and then I know I'm in the team. Do you have any advice from Kristen that will she's been there for She was just saying, like, not to look at my composition, just go out there and focus on my race, my lane, do what I'm supposed to do, and then everything will be all right. My favorite part was definitely conference. Yeah, winning as a freshman. And then like at nationals when I was like announced the fastest freshman in history. That was my favorite part. In terms of fan media attention, do you think that has been the biggest event you've ever competed in for a championship? Yes, it is the biggest event. I, it's going to be nerve-wracking. I just have to keep calm, do what I always do, listen to music, I mean, just focus on me. Not really. I'm just always by myself listening to music. My goal first is to meet these semifinals, take each round one step at a time, and just to be a good ambassador for myself, my country, and my school. She's been, she's always on my back telling me what to do, what's right, and whatever. And she's like always there for me, she's like my mom. Uh, she's been a big help, like improving my hurdles, skills, my time. Like she's always like there for me, pushing me, telling me that I can do it. So I believe in myself even more that I can. I must say, winning the NCAA title, that was that was a big start for me. I really wanted that title, knowing it's my last year, and I really got it. And this year, I'm I'm living the my moment, the moment for life. This year. Um, it's a good feeling. It's good to be in the company of Sonny Richards Ross and Courtney O'Colo. And now I, I leave Texas knowing that I, I am an NCAA champion. And that's a good feeling. I always want that. And I got it my last year and I'm so grateful, so grateful of the help of Coach Bailey. Um, I think um, the setbacks I had indoors, you know, I think it helped me a lot mentally. I got mentally strong for outdoors and each meet, I keep surprising myself, I'm running PRs after PRs, and you know, everything is just going great. Yes. Um, it's a different feeling. Um, this is my third senior team, and um, I'm always going, you know, for the relay. I'm always in the relay pool, but this year I get a lane for myself. I know I can, you know, run the 400 and the 4x4 four four instead of going in the 4x4 four four pool. So it means a lot to me, and I can't wait to step on the track and, you know, run, run the way I train, and hopefully I can get some more PRs, and hopefully I can get on the podium too. Uh, it's a good feeling knowing that I have my teammates with me. Just sad that Courtney and Marlick and Ashley and Byron, they're not going to be there this year. Like last year, we were all at the Olympics. But um, I'm still happy that I have um, a couple of them there that's going to be there with me. That's going to be there with me. Not yet. We are just training right now and getting prepared for the championships because this is very big for us. First time both of us going to Worlds to run individual races. So 
I mean, we get to talk. Hopefully, we'll be in the same room so I can give her that prep talk that I always does all the time. Um, yes. Um, when you talk about momentum, I think that I have a race plan right now that I'm going to stick with for the entire time because over the years, even though I've been running the 400 for a long time, I've been always trying to figure out um, how can I, you know, run a race a certain way for a long time. I've been searching for a race strategy, and now that I found one, I'm just going to stick to it. And if I, if I do that, I'll be, I'll be, I'm going to do well. That will be fine. Um, just get out aggressive, and I'll be fine. Because sometimes if I don't get out aggressive, it kind of messes up some part of the race. And, you know, if I don't get out aggressive, maybe I run the back stretch a little bit too hard, and then I cannot finish. But if I get out aggressive, I can hold that momentum um, for the entire race. So that is the plan I'm going to stick with. Yes, definitely, because I wanted, if I wanted, I'm a professional athlete now, but Thinking back then, I was saying to myself, if I wanted to be a professional athlete, I have to have a, you know, a set strategy on how to execute my race if I want to run well. I can't be changing up all the time. So now I've found and I feel comfortable with it, and that's the way I'm going to run all the time. <laughs> um... Me and Rochelle, we have a different relationship. She's like my daughter. She can be very hard to deal with at times, but um, she listens to me most of the time, and that's what I like. Um, I want to win a lot of world and Olympic medals. I want to be ranked in the top all time, and you know. I'm just looking to have some fun in my career, not taking stuff too seriously because, you know, if I take it too seriously and then I get hurt, you know, I'm going to, you know, maybe lose my mind. So I'm trying to have another side of life. That's why I want my degree so, you know, I can do other things. Um, it meant a lot to me. I had some awesome teammates. They always, you know, motivate me and, Sometimes when I think, when, for instance, we in training talking about times, and I was like, oh, that's impossible, I can't do it. They're always there to be like, yeah, you can do it, you know, and that's what I like. That's what pushes me all the time. I would tell them that Austin is an awesome place. Um, they, not make, they may not get the food, the Jamaican food that they want, the, the real authentic thing, but uh, they have some nice restaurants here. Uh, um, University of Texas is an awesome school, awesome programs, and you know, they look out for us, not, not on the track alone, but off the track where education is concerned.